Hello my viewers. Once again I was lucky enough that my neighbor was having troubles with something that I could fix. Uh, this time it was her refrigerator. In this case the defrost heating element went bad. You'll probably hear her kids in the background. Roll them. Alright this is a refrigerator. Uh, Here's the freezer part, and it's been having a problem. It's been having some defrost problems, and the evaporator coil is right back here. So let's uh, take this panel off and see if it's all frosted up. I'll pull this panel off up here, away from the coil. Alright, now look at that evaporator coil right here. This thing is a, just all frosted up, so it's not defrosting properly. I think I know what the problem is. Up down here is the defrost heating element right here okay I've already disconnected it and I'm going to replace this because so you take a look at this defrost heating element it's completely broken right here so this is the reason that this refrigerator has not been defrosting properly now here I have a brand new one as you see it's in good shape because it's well brand new we're going to thaw this coil is with a heat gun. You can watch. Now I'm going to install this new defrost heater right over here. Now first we'll plug in these wires on these connectors. And this. There we go. Right. All we have to do is put the screws in place. Okay, that pretty much shows you how to install the defrost heating element. The next step is to reinstall this panel. Okay, that goes in. Next step is to reinstall this panel that goes in front of the evaporator. Screws back in place. And And of course, we'll screw the light bulb back in place. And now I'm going to go and turn the power back on the breaker. And there you have it. It's working good now.